Gary, a win on the final home game of the season seems somewhat fitting after the form you've had here. Yeah, I think it's really pleasing for us and we wanted to give the crowd that final game, that final performance and the final win. Um, I think that was important to us and I'm sure there'd have been a great atmosphere regardless of the result. But uh, I think on the whole, we, we, we had probably the lion's share of the game. Um, I felt as though first half we had four or five decent chances um, to their one or two and then second half it became a bit more open but again we really looked like the side doing most of the attacking which I was pleased with and we've done that so often and I think you know when we came in people said that second half we seemed to die at home but I think second half we've tended to get stronger in games um, and also with the substitutions it's allowed us to keep chasing the game with a little bit more tempo and uh, I, I'm pleased for Lloyd today because um, obviously like, like it's been well documented he's perhaps not uh, the fans perhaps not have warmed to him as, as much as he would have liked and we would have liked, but I think today showed what he's all about. You know, it was a fantastic finish to win us a game. Were you pleased with uh, the tempo that your side showed today? Because at Blackburn, that's something that was a bit of a concern, especially first half. Well, I said that to them. I said, we can't allow that to happen today. We've got to lift the crowd straight away. We've got to show a little bit more urgency. And I think we did that. I think first half, perhaps, we played into Charlton's hands by passing it across the back. Um, and when you do that, they get their shape just like we would get our shape. And it's very difficult then to play through them or to get like of Diego onto the ball. And uh, I felt when we started playing forward a little earlier, then Diego lands on seconds and he's in a little bit of space and our wide men can then get up the pitch. So um, I was pleased with certain elements of our performance, but I think overall we deserved the win. Uh, delighted that we got it. And, and like you say, you know, really have put the, put the icing on top of the, uh, the cake that is our home form. And it was another a late winner by, by Lloyd Dunn. It was a fantastic goal as well. Yeah, brilliant strike. Uh, fantastic strike. Um, you know, and it, I've seen him do that so often in his career. And that's why I brought him to the club, because I felt as though he could be a real asset. Um, and, and again, for someone like him to be able to bring a, a player of his calibre onto the pitch um, and the likes of Wes, you know, really just gives us that little bit of impetus in the last 10, 15 minutes. And, and I've always said at home, we've got to try and win the game. You know, if that means we take a little bit of a gamble, we've got to try and win the game. And, and, and I thought that gamble paid off today. And the, the two results you've had this week shown that you're not prepared to just float your way to the end of the season. Now you're up into the top half as well. Yeah, but that's, that's the aim. I said to the players, we want to finish in the top 10. Uh, I think that'd be an amazing achievement for us. And, and why not you know, try to aspire to that? And, and that's what we've done since we've come in. We've said, can we keep climbing the table? None more so than now. Um, and, I, and I think the players should be really proud of that. I think the fans deserved us to go out and appreciate them today. And I think the, uh, the players deserve that appreciation from the fans. I just want to say as well, I mean, it's always a difficult one. You know, I go out first on, on the, the lap of honour and, and of course I'm the manager. But uh, I have to say that the, the, the staff have been brilliant since we've come in. The ones that I brought in from Burton and all the existing ones, you know. And I think really, I don't want to take the credit today. I want the, uh, the, the staff to take the credit because they've worked so hard over the last six months. Um, and a lot of it goes unnoticed. But the fans obviously are very appreciative of you and your staff, which must be nice for you because you came in in pretty difficult circumstances. Well, yeah, I, I took my daughter, well, one of my daughters round. Um, I could have took all four of my kids, but I didn't have enough arms to, uh, to hold on to them. So um, I took my daughter around and I just said to her, you know, let's, uh, let's appreciate this, what a great fans they are. I said, it might not always be like this, I said to her, and she started laughing. Um, but we're pleased with what we've done. But what that doesn't mean is, that doesn't mean that the work stops. You know, that means we have to work even harder now. Um, and, and to be honest with you, that's brilliant, and I really appreciate that. But my mind's on next week already. My mind's on next season already. Um, and I think that's how it's got to be. We've got to keep advancing and, and keep progressing.